Hello everybody, welcome to my channel Crypto Explorer. In today's video, I'm going to talk about Komodo and their road to 1 million. Not 1 million dollars per Komodo, but 1 million transactions per second. Before I start, please note that nothing on my channel is financial advice. This is only my personal opinion. According to the article on Komodo's website, Komodo has developed a new scaling solution that provides more transactions per second than any other blockchain project in existence. They have already achieved more than 20,000 verified transactions per second in their live public tests and sustained an average of 19,500 transactions per second for a period of 14 minutes. Komodo states that their tech is theoretically able to handle 1 million transactions per second. Komodo's road to 1 million is their campaign to get the hardware required to conduct the scaling test to prove this theory. Um, Komodo is also working on a protocol that will allow 100 payments per transactions, which would mean each transaction would be able to do 100 million payments per second. Pretty amazing stuff there. You can read more about it in this article they posted on their website, and I'll put a link in the description below. So at 20,000 transactions per second, I believe Waves is the next fastest, fastest blockchain, active blockchain, at 1,000 transactions per second. So last year, um, they there was an article about Waves NG where they compared um, transactions per second with Visa, Bitcoin, and Ethereum. Visa does a roughly averages 2,000 per second. Bitcoin 3 and Ethereum at 5. So Waves NG uh, can process up to 1,000, a, a but Komodo here now um, does 20,000, and they've proven it through a public uh, test. So I'm not counting EOS yet, as they have just launched their mainnet. And I know EOS is supposed to be doing uh, a million transactions per second, um, but um, I don't know if they have that verified publicly. Um, that that I'd have to check. But um, they have just launched their mainnet, and they're kind of going through some what seems to be some uh, governance issues. But um, I really do hope they solve it soon, as I do hold some EOS and would like to see them succeed as well. Personally, I like Komodo a lot. Um, I participated in their crowd sale back in 2016. Um, and I think the team at Komodo are very, very focused on development over hype or price. Uh, a lot of times you hear about crypto's project, crypto projects whose immediate goals after they do an ICO or a crowd sale is to get on exchange so they can be traded already. For me, Komodo is not one of those projects. If you're not familiar with Komodo, I encourage you to check them out. You can find more about them on their website over here. Um, you can see the features that Komodo platform has. It's pretty much an end-to-end blockchain in a box type of solution where um, you have all these tools made available to you for you to develop your blockchain project. Personally, one of my favorite tool parts of Komodo is the de delayed proof of work security where they notarize to the Bitcoin blockchain. So in order to compromise Komodo's security, you would actually have to compromise the Bitcoin blockchain security as well. They have um, privacy features um, and they also have smart contracts. But I'll put a link there and you can find out more about them. It's actually kind of interesting too, because if you look at over here um, under smart contracts, that the developer can use any programming language that they choose to create programmable contracts. And it brought me to this, uh, reminded me of this story uh, back in May. Uh, GLX um, actually moved from developing on Ethereum to Komodo. And you can see here, um, the CEO and founder of GLX says it is always a difficult decision to totally scrap time and money spent on tech development. That said, I stand 100% behind our decision to move from Ethereum to the Komodo platform. We have accomplished more 
blockchain development in the last four weeks with Komodo than we did in the previous 12 months trying to develop on Ethereum. Now, Ethereum uses its own programming language, but Komodo allows you to use any programming language you choose to create and program your contracts. Pretty interesting stuff. So I encourage you to just check it out, see what they have to offer. I, I, I see great things happening with this project, especially with the way they focus on development over hype or price. Well, that's it for this video about Komodo and their road to 1 million. Thank you for watching.